No, I had to let her go, cause she can't arrest me. Walk away my Tuli, what he do? Back in July 2018, Playboy Cardi went on record to share that he and Lil Uzi Vert had some unreleased music in the vault. How many records do y'all have together that we haven't heard? I got a hundred. A hundred? Yeah. Jesus. We, we, we been recording since like 2015, you know, you know what I'm saying? So we just like, we know what we gotta do. We know what we capable of. Now with the second anniversary of Cardi's self-titled mixtape and Uzi's return from retirement with tracks like Free Uzi, Sanguine Paradise, and That's a Rack, many are hoping the two collaborate again. So Genius decided to take a look back at their friendship. Both Uzi and Cardi emerged as stars of hip hop's new generation, landing coveted spots in the 2016 and 2017 Double XL freshman class, respectively. Though both artists had been getting tons of buzz in the years before, in 2016 they teamed up for their first official release on Left Right, which resulted in a nine city tour. Diamonds dancing like Beyonce got shots in my room. Like that's right, bitch. Better make that cash. Like that's right, bitch. Better shake that ass. Later that year, Uzi enlisted Cardi for the Molly Raw produced track of course we get flowers on the perfect love tape. Walk around Christian Lou, what? Diamonds all on my sneaks. Yeah, you up a boy got Bella. Don't even talk to me. Don't fly to LA for a week. And I got Rick on my teeth. And I got Rick on my feet. Chopper on me. Sagging my jeans. These duets inspired more releases from the pair in 2017. That March, ahead of the release of his self-titled mixtape, Cardi dropped two more official tracks featuring Uzi, Lookin' and Woke Up Like This. Cardi bought a six and a four of the right lane. Damn that boy, ask it for some more, like the Sprite clean. I'm like, dirty up the Sprite, please. With some mice, with my bees and like the ceiling. And Uzi made sure to support Cardi's debut mixtape. Hey, listen here. My brother Cardi just dropped the best goddamn album that I ever heard. And although sometimes working together can be a struggle. All right, so let me tell you something about Cardi. He's he's really psyched out. Me and Cardi be really having to like we gotta fight, like physically fight for him to listen. At the end of the day, the love is real. Me and Uzi be in the studio together at all times, and we just be knowing. You know what I'm saying? We just we're a team. I just went to the store. Yeah. For the love. Yeah. Hey. We're back to the stuff. That's just what? Up. Yeah, you feel me? It's just lit. That's all it's all about being lit. In May 2017, both rappers made an appearance on the feature pack track Raph from ASAP Mob's Cozy Tapes Volume 2. In August, Uzi dropped his critically acclaimed debut studio album Love is Rage 2, featuring the hit Exo Tour Life. In September, Cardi teased a joint album on Snapchat, and less than a month later, Break the Bank dropped, giving fans hope that it might really happen. Diamond wet like, oh, diamond wet like, oh. A month later, Cardi announced their 1629 tour, but the next day, Uzi bowed out, saying, quote, not going on tour with Cardi, need to focus. Though the two didn't hit the road together, they kept making music. Tracks like Bankroll, as well as snippets like I'm With The Squad, also known as Squad or Firearm, surfaced in the following months. In May 2018, Cardi's debut studio album, Die Lit, dropped, and Shooter became the pair's first official release since 2017's Woke Up Like This. You know that I'm smoking dope, I'll be hot till next week. No, I had to let her go, cause she can't arrest me. Uh, woke up with my Tuli, what they do? Uh, meet me in the alley with the troops. By the end of late 2018, Uzi was visibly going through some business issues with his label Generation Now. He announced his retirement from music and thanked his fans for their support. But by March 2019, the Philly rapper released Free Uzi, delighting his fans and continuing the hope for the release of Eternal A Take, his second major label album. And though there's no official release date for 1629, now that Uzi's album may really be on the horizon, fans could have a new Cardi Uzi collab to look forward to. Woke up to niggas like me. Woke up to niggas talking like me. Oh, I think they like me. Yup. Am I white? I'm Tia with Genius News, bringing you the meaning and the knowledge behind the music.